Hello, bro. <sighs> Why do I do that, Jose? Fuck's sake. Hey, everyone. Back for another video. This one, we've pre-built the PC. We've got this really nice looking Lian Li 011 Dynamic Evo. We've got a 4080 Aero 7900X. All the Lian Li stuff, including the streamer cables. And to make it a little bit different for this raffle, which it should be going live anytime soon, we're gonna put a seven inch screen in the back. So, needs a bit of modification, but I looked online and there aren't that many videos, so I thought, why not film one? Show everyone what we did. Hopefully it comes out all right, I'm sure it will. And then we'll also do the setup of Ada64, the program that you need to run all of the software so you can see all of the readings from your temperatures to your clock speeds, anything that you wanna do. So, let's have a look. I was trying to be a bit more calm this time. Yeah. Hope it doesn't come across grumpy. Right, so parts-wise, we've got a seven-inch LCD screen. This, everything here to do all this is from Amazon. So Jose's gonna put some work in, put the links in the description, I'll send them all to him. So it should be quite easy. We've got a, yeah, the seven-inch screen. You get some, an HDMI and a few adapters. You don't need any of those. We've got a one meter HDMI and another one meter micro USB. The micro USB is the power. And I've bought a standoff kit. So there's loads in here. It's gonna come in super handy for future things. So I think we're gonna need the smallest ones for this. And I've also got a couple of just spare washers because I think this, the screws are quite small for, that come in the standoff. First things first, I have had a little bit of prep work and I've lined up, put the standoffs on the back of the screen, smallest ones in the box. I'm gonna face the cables going up You've, you can see on the back here that you've got the power touch. We don't, we don't need the touch screen, even though the screen could be touch screen. And then the HDMI. I think the best way to route this, so you'd think maybe go through the bottom. I think for tidiness, we're gonna go up through the back where the CPU power comes in and then go out of the back through this grommet, straight into the power for the screen and the display port on the HDMI. Just go back to that. Go USB for the power and the HDMI for to display whatever you want on it. So a bit of the prep work beforehand was to line up with the standoffs, line up the screen. Like I said, put cables up the top and think where you're gonna get it. And when I looked at this, that it looks obvious where you'd put the screw holes, but they don't, not all four of them line up. So what I've done is I've made a bit of a Sharpie mark and we're gonna drill some holes. I hope this works. Nah, 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 it's not a hat. No, no. It's not a hat, it even says it's not a hat. <laughs> no, no, what no, no, the no. fuck are you doing? The definition of a hat, if it says something about covering your hair. My hair's yeah, not right. covered. It is covered. <laughs> it's not covered. No, I watched most of it, it's not hat finish it. is a covering for the head. So you covering your head. My head's not covered. Hat. It is covered. It's not. Part of it is. No, let him go looking like that. <laughs> Boss is here. Let, whoa, hold it, up. I'm not going with boss. We don't do boss around here. Holes are drilled, ready for the screen. I'm not wearing a hat uh, this week. So if you watched last week's video, I was proven completely right. Luke was wrong. Luke was supposed to not wear a hat this week. Not so wearing apparently a hat. he's not wearing a hat. It's not a hat. Okay. It's not. It's definitely not a hat, is it? No, it's, it's even named not a hat. Right, I think best bet is to put the cables in first before we... Oh God, you, I flinched so bad. Oh. What do you think, Luke? Yeah. Seven inch screen, looking pretty cool. You're gonna set up eight to 64, aren't you? No, back okay. to the seven inch, because the mum's yeah, had too much okay. of the 14 inch. And we gave them a break, so we're starting them in preheating the oven. A bit of seven <laughs> inch. Root these. This should all oh, go. Oh, wait, whoa, hold up. Right. Kick check. They look at Dusty there. What are they? Look. Oh my word. They're a week old. What are they called? Pandas. No, Pan dunk. Panglo. Pandas. Pandas. So you know when he roasted you for the what the every white girl wears? Yeah, all the white girls are wearing them. Oh, aren't they? the pandas. That's what they were like. Yeah, isn't all the it? chavy girls are wearing them. Yeah, I've got today another pair of Union LA. Dunk are they the ones lows. that rip off? No, yeah, they are. They <laughs> are. But don't, don't do that. The ones that you can't remember the name of. Back to screenage. You can be of help, and not with that fist. Right. Can you hold that in place? No, 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 it's gonna work, isn't it? Oh, for fuck's sake. 
It's working. It's, it, I can't see the screw hole. Look, look, Luke. It's Can you like see doing it in the there? Dark, James. there it's just look. like doing it in the right, dark. Jose, you still come get see in the this. hole. It's just like doing it in the dark, James. You've just got to feel around and get it in there. Okay, Night tonight, winner. Oh, there we go. Got it. Tonight. How many? Oh yeah, the mic. That was really loud, wasn't it? <laughs> what did you do? This. <laughs> well done. This is going extremely well, isn't it? It's in. Look at that, that looks perfect. OEM. That is done. How easy was that? All you need is a hand. Huh? The rubber fist that costs 60 quid. Looks good, Luke, do you think? Well done. All done. How, well, much, how much do you think that cost you? 100 quid. 120 quid. I don't know, it's, things aren't that cheap. No, it's about 150 pounds, I think. Oh, yeah, but we'll put, the, we, we'll put the links in the description. Right, okay, we're gonna set it up and show a bit of a tutorial on Ada 64. Cool. Cool. Do you need... No. High five? No. High five? No. Go on. No, I'm not that doing it. That was so close. I thought I was doing it. Yeah, you did think... Okay, so the screen is all powering up. The PC's done, ready to go. We're just going to now change the settings to put some details, some graphs, a few performance figures. Right, so first things first, we need to change the orientation. So we're going to go into the display settings. Select on the second display. Windows identifies it automatically change it to portrait, keep these settings, and then we are going to click on the taskbar and on the taskbar settings, go down to taskbar behavior and change, show my taskbar on all displays, turn that off, and as you'll see on the screen, it's gone, so the taskbar doesn't interfere or anything. Next thing we wanna do, so the program we use is Ada64, I've already put that in the search bar here. Go to downloads and you want Ada64 Extreme. You get a 30 day free trial with this. So try it out, see if you like it. If you want to buy it, you get it's 55 pounds for three licenses. It's well worth it in my opinion. Okay, so now that that is downloaded, we will open it up. Launch Ada64 Extreme. I'm now gonna enter the product key, Jose Blur this. Okay, product key in, we've got full version. Put that to one side. Now we're going to go and we're going to go on the Ada64 forum. What you want to do on here is you want to create an account and log in because if you don't, you won't actually be able to download any of the, the packs that people have created. The, the easiest way for on this forum is to find one that you like. What I did is I searched for the orientation of my display. So that will then show you every sensor panel that's available in that orientation. I've gone through here, there's nine pages, so there's plenty to choose from, and I like the look. I like the look of this one. We'll go to their post, download sensor panel, make sure you're logged in, remember. Okay, in Ada64, we're gonna go to file preferences, go down to sensor panel here and click show sensor panel. Like press apply. Sensor panel manager, and we're gonna import sensor panel and there we go right let's bring it back and let's change the values to suit our system the person that made this had a Ryzen 7 5800X so we need to change that to ours you can see here it's to label so we double click that simple and easy change that to ours which is 5900X press OK and you can see that's changed we're gonna leave the the temperature the load everything looks good on that let's go to the GPU next there's the GPU and we have a Gigabyte 4080. Press OK. There we go. Temperature's fine. Let's change the motherboard to ours, which they have a Trix as well, but we're going to go B650A Gaming. There we go. That's changed. And all you need to do really now is, if you're going to do this for yourself, is just go through, just have a look. So. For example, this is the GPU fans. Well, the fans aren't running at the moment, so there's nothing on there. But let's look at, say, chassis one. You can change this to anything you want. Cooling fan there. We could change that if we wanted to, to anything. These are all sensor panel items. You can do whatever you want. You can change it. If you've got loads of fans, you can change them all to different readings. We'll go through this now quickly, tailor it to our needs, and then come back in a minute. <laughs> 